Welcome back to the Seriously Series show. I want to thank Livy for taking time out of her busy schedule and joining us on the Seriously Serious show, talking about some serious matters, but also matters where I think it, what, what's amazing is you see positive progress. And so I just want to thank her. Uh, thank you for getting her on the show. Mm -hmm. Ladies, you need to continue to hear truth. And guys, too. Uh, we, we talk a lot that ladies have this perspective, but guys have crazy perspectives about uh, themselves, too. And you need to realize that Jesus loves you in radical ways. But make sure you check that website out. Thank you again for joining the show. I also want to talk to you about Bethel 101. Now, Bethel College uh, has a great, unique opportunity for any of you that are right now are a freshman, sophomore, or junior in high school, uh, and your parents. You uh, can go to a campus visit day designed specifically to help select a major, uh, the college application process, financial assistance, and more. You also explore life at Bethel College through a campus tour, chapel service, and lunch. Bethel is an accredited Christian college located in Northern Indiana. To reserve your spot, make sure you go to BethelCollege.edu backslash sign me up. That's BethelCollege.edu backslash sign me up. So make sure you do that now. Do not wait. Do not make excuses. Do it now, people. Do it now. Now, we've had a crazy day already. Mm -hmm. I, I feel like the, especially this week has just been crazy uh, with the new studio. But we've been having a blast from Spencer all the way to Dave playing our games that are just horrible, having special guests on. It's been unique. And then you tell me this story and it just brought me down. This story Ooh. about a, a guy that uh, sneezing? sneezing? Yeah. Well, and I can relate because I've been sneezing a lot recently. And I'm the type of sneezer that when I'm around people that I don't know, I have the proper etiquette. I, I sneeze into my elbow, right? But when I'm around people like I know, and especially if I know that they're germaphobes, like I full out go, <gasps> and I like exasperate the, the pressure out of my nasal whatever, and I spit and I do all of that stuff. It's pretty fantastic, in fact. But this is, this is actually a sad story in the fact that this gentleman, he suffered from high blood pressure due to a disease overall, but he sneezed six times in a row and it actually made his brain hemorrhage. And so he died from sneezing. Like how crazy is that? I mean, that's like on the official whatever report. I want to say coroner's report. Is that right? Yeah. Well, let's yeah. go with it. Like, yeah, that that works. Sounds legit, of course. But I'm like, oh, the really? I mean, if I go out of this world, and I, I mean, because to live is for Christ, to die is gain, right? But like, how do you, you want to go out? Oh, eaten by a great white shark, of course. I mean, really, who who has anything other than that, right? I can tell you, I want to be an older, I don't want to die now, but yeah. if I'm willing to die, this is what I want to do. I want to be, and I've thought about this. Even when I was in high school, I thought about this. I want there to be cars going out of control. There's a baby on the side of this going out of control. I end up, I'm driving in the car. I have to open up the door. I reach down. <laughs> scoop the I baby scoop up. I scoop the baby up. <laughs> I save it. I run. No, no, this is a full story. We're not stopping there. I run out the back of the car out the back window. As it hits another car, it crashes. I'm dead serious. I've thought about this. I jump. I With jump. With the baby still I'm in hand. I'm running on the semi. No, I am running on the semi, holding it. So the semi's still going. I'm on top of the semi, and the semi's going to run into another semi. But you know what? There's an overpass there. And the mom's up there on top of the overpass. And as the two semis hit, I go and I throw the baby in the air and the mom catches it and then I just bite it. I bite it as I fly because I couldn't get it and that's how I die. <laughs> and that's how I want it to, to go. Does that work? Does that work for you? <laughs> And I you know what's no words. and you know what's funny is it's all true. I was I re, I remember starting to put it all together in high school, and it took me till a couple. Yeah, I had to because it's. I even gave you like there's a little bit of other. There's words that are said. There's dialogue. Like people are yelling at me. Like get. Yeah, so there's a whole backstory to it, and there's 
I want the, the way the flames go, but I know I can't control all of it. But that's, you know, me and God have talked, and hopefully that's the way I go. When you know what's fascinating? When I'm 75 and I'm like Harrison Ford. 75, <laughs> no less. Wow. And I'm just, if I'm 60, I'll, I'll do it too. I'll be, but I'm, I'm just real, I am nervous about the throw. I am right, nervous about the sure throw because I wouldn't yeah. want everything to go according to plan right. and then the throw to go bad. Because, I mean, you don't want the baby to get hurt at all. No, I want the baby like to land perfectly in the mother's arms, yeah. realize it's with its mom. It's happy. happy. It the mom laughing. is crying right. of just tears of joy. And right. then I just bite it. Like, But I want an instant one. I want one where I'm yeah. not like, they're like in pain. I just want boom. Right, done. Boom. Like just Meet to, Jesus. And I, I hi Jesus and I saved a child. Nice. That's a good way to go. I mean, legitimately. <laughs> it is a good way. It reminds me of the Matrix, though I think maybe you copyrighted that a little bit. But you know, it's okay. It's maybe, good. Maybe. Maybe. Yeah, yeah. I wasn't wearing a leather the jacket semi, and though, uh, the sunglasses the semi, at the time. Yeah. So mm. Hey, I just. Uh, it was legit. I, I think. It was uh, legit. That or sharks. Maybe someone was watching Jaws too much over there. Oh my there. gosh. It's <laughs> a good way to go, dude. I'm telling you. Because you know I like sharks. How I do. Is that a good way to go? Especially if it bites off your arm, you're still alive and there's still more to come. And yeah. it's just like twin with you. No, bleeding to death, I hear, is a good way to go, though, because it's a slow, gradual, you're euphoric, it's, it's a pleasurable, and then you just fall asleep. Aww. And then I'm just stroking the shark's head, like, it's okay. I don't feel bitter. <laughs> my arm and leg is gone, but it's okay. I don't believe this at all. <laughs> Actually, my baby's story is a lot more real <laughs> than that. So, oh, golly. I hope you guys are having a good time out there. Uh, I, I feel, though, God has me on this earth to do a lot more and uh, to be part of his plan. And it's part of God's plan for what he wants me to do down here and for you. So yeah. I'm excited to continue to be on here and hopefully give you guys some laugh. Hope you guys are having a good time out there. We're going to play one more song and then we are giving away the $25 Amazon gift card. So make sure you stick around. So much more to come on the Seriously Serious Show.